a Muslim invented the camera. Let me ask you a question. How do you see? And before you start typing here, here, here with my eyes, I mean, how do your eyes actually work? Scholars of antiquity like Plato would say, light actually emits from your eyes and objects are caught in its rays, like your Superman shooting lasers from your eyes. But around the year 1000, Hassan ibn al-Haytham, a mathematician, physicist, and astronomer from Basra, was the first to explain how light actually bounces off of objects and into your eyes. This may sound like secondary school physics to you, but it was revolutionary for its time. Ibn al-Haytham was all about rigorous experimentation and proofs. To prove his theory, he experimented in a dark room with a pinhole, allowing light through. And the light entering this room would project an image of the outside onto the back wall. The technology to record this image wouldn't be invented till much later, but this setup would be known as camera. This room setup shrunk to the size of a box. It would then be Latinized as camera obscura. This simple setup going through generations of iteration and improvement, add some photosensitive chemicals here and some glass lenses there, resulting in things from the modern camera to the phone in your hand right now. And none of it would have been possible without Hassan ibn al-Haytham.